This, folks, is an Australian didgeridoo, Aboriginal musical instrument, which is made of a piece of wood that is hollowed out by termites. Uh, I'm not very good at playing it, but... <laughs> However, this has nothing to do with this time of year. This is the time of the year that we use a ram's horn. A ram is an adult male sheep, and it was the animal that Avraham, Abraham saw on Mount Moriah caught by its horn in a bush. And uh, we remind ourselves of Avraham's devotion to God and of God's love for Avraham. We remind ourselves of the hope. We remind ourselves of a victory blow in war. We remind ourselves of the sound of a, of a lion roaring, which, which makes you shudder and shake, etc. There's a whole lot of cultural baggage, all good stuff with the shofar, which I don't really have with the didgeridoo, even though I'm Australian. But this is the time of the year when... <coughs> When we blow the shofar, coming up to Rosh Hashanah, when we hear 100 blows of the, of the shofar, hopefully imitating our, both our cries regarding our sins, but also our cries of hope and our tears of joy in the idea of redemption, both personal and national. So uh, uh, enjoy didgeridoo anytime during the year, but the shofar, this is the time of the year. Shana Tovat on the Sukkah. Have a happy, sweet new year.